Welcome to AI Latest Industry Trends. Generative AI at work could increase the racial wealth gap in the U.S. between black and white households by $43 billion by 2045, according to new McKinsey research. Right Aid will have to stop using facial recognition surveillance in its stores for five years under a proposed settlement with the U.S. Federal Trade Commission. OpenAI outlines a safety plan for dealing with the dangers of AI. Washington lawmakers propose legislation for AI task force. Life predictions made possible by artificial intelligence, researchers show. TomTom teamed up with Microsoft to develop an AI-driven conversational assistant for cars. AI revolutionizes policing and security at the Olympics and beyond. Chinese firms look to Malaysia for assembly of high-end chips, sources say. U.S. Senators Mark Warner, Democrat Virginia, and John Kennedy, Republican Louisiana, introduced a bill targeting the misuse of AI and deepfakes in financial markets. One million pound prize opens for AI innovations in energy, environment, and infrastructure. Canadian healthcare startup Lydia AI expands reach in South Korea. Gen Robotics chosen among top three Indian startups at Global AI Summit. OpenAI just published a new safety preparedness framework for managing AI, including granting the newly reconstructed board power to reverse executive decisions on releasing concerning models. Al Gore Education raises a $1.5 million seed, concept maps and automatic summary starting from any document with AI. Magic Feedback raises a $1.3 million seed, unify and categorize user feedback with AI. Mistral AI unveils Law Platform with multilingual chat and embedding endpoints in beta. Google launches Gemini API and advanced AI tools for developers. An AI model trained on the life events of 6 million Danish citizens proved highly accurate at predicting mortality, outperforming tools traditionally used by insurers in assessing risk. Microsoft enhances Azure AI Cloud with new models and fine-tuning capabilities. Tenix announces fine-tuning solution to address catastrophic forgetting in LLMs. Study, bots now beating humans at CAPTCHAs. Microsoft's AI chatbot, Copilot, can now generate songs based on text prompts. Tesla recently released a video of their advanced humanoid robot, Optimus Gen 2, showing significant improvements over the first version. Google unveiled MusicFX, its next-generation artificial intelligence music generator. The tool lets you create a sample instrumental track in seconds from just a few words of text. Stability AI recently launched Stable 0123, their latest image model that promises a giant leap in 3D model creation. The research took into account the most commonly used versions of CAPTCHAs on popular websites with 1,400 participants solving over 14,000 CAPTCHAs. Bots are scoring up to 100% and 99% in terms of accuracy for some CAPTCHA tests. Runaway Research unveils a general world model, an AI system that builds an internal representation of an environment and uses it to simulate future events within that environment. In 2023, Big tech firms like Microsoft have significantly increased their AI startup collaborations. AZIP Incorporated, MIT, and UC teams have achieved a milestone in AI, large models creating smaller, specialized AI independently. An innovative Danish AI model trained on vast data excels in mortality risk prediction. Google's Bard, enhanced by the Gemini model, launches in the UK, rivaling ChatGPT. Turkey's Revo Capital plans to raise a $100 million fund for local AI startups, marking its first gaming and energy investments. Redactable, an AI platform for securely redacting sensitive documents, has raised $5.5 million, addressing the growing need for reliable data security in digital document sharing. OpenAI has decided to buff its AI safety team by creating a new safety advisory group that will make recommendations to the leadership, with the board retaining veto power. OpenAI partners with a major publisher to add recent, authoritative content to ChatGPT. Microsoft shares research on getting the best performance out of foundation models. Microsoft releases a new high-powered small language model. Google releases iMagin 2, its most advanced text-to-image system. Google makes Gemini Pro available to developers. A congressional candidate is using AI to have conversations with thousands of voters. Google introduces new capabilities across its AI stack to support Gemini. Apple launches AI-powered journal app. In preparation for the 2024 Olympics, NICE, France, 
is enhancing law enforcement by integrating AI with its extensive network of 4,200 cameras, using advanced features like facial recognition and movement algorithms to detect infractions and suspicious activities. ChatGPT has gotten lazier, a new theory called the winter break hypothesis, which is supported by statistically significant data. According to the VP of LinkedIn, the shelf life of college degrees are shrinking dramatically in the age of AI. HNR Block has launched AI Tax Assist, a new AI-powered chatbot to answer users' tax questions within its paid DIY tax filing software. Users can ask about tax rules, exemptions, deductions, and more. Researchers from CMU and Microsoft introduced TinyGSM, a synthetic dataset containing GSM 8K style math word problems paired with Python solutions. Driving advanced analytics outcomes at scale using Amazon SageMaker powered PWC's machine learning ops accelerator. Study from MetaGen AI proposes a groundbreaking quantization strategy for enhancing latent diffusion models using SQNR metrics. European Union releases a QNA on its new AI Act legislation. IBM is set to acquire stream sets and web methods from Software AG for $2.3 billion, with the technology supporting IBM's AI ambitions by integrating with its Watson X AI and data platform. New York City Council member-elect Susan Zhuang admitted to using AI to help respond to a questionnaire from a local publication due to English not being her first language. OpenAI's new board of directors maintains the power to override any decisions made by CEO Sam Altman, including on the release of potential artificial general intelligence AGI, systems. Sam Altman gives new interview on OpenAI, AI risks and rewards, and artificial general intelligence. New report details how Google got back on its feet in the AI race. OpenAI releases a new research direction on superalignment of superhuman AI systems. Google DeepMind publishes research on how to make new discoveries in math and science using large language models. OpenAI, Meta, and Microsoft are chasing wearable AI. Japan startup Preferred Networks designs its own AI chips to beat bottleneck. AI-driven advancements in electronic skin technology promise revolution in health monitoring and diagnostics. EU to expand support for AI startups to tap its supercomputers for model training. Men vs. Machine, AI beats human in mental and physical game for the first time. AI imaging bias reduces diagnostic accuracy. Microsoft Copilot gets a music creation feature via Suno integration. India working on creating a global framework for artificial intelligence, PM Modi. Regulation could shape AI in 2024, with big tech best poised to gain, experts say. TomTom Tom creates AI-based conversational assistant for vehicles with Microsoft. The more workers use AI, the more they worry about their job security, survey finds. OpenAI suspends ByteDance account over use of GPT for training its own AI model. U.S. Senators propose tough fines for AI-driven securities fraud or market manipulation. Alphabet to limit election queries barred and AI-based search can answer. Right aid ban from using AI facial recognition. Bill Gates, optimistic, about role AI could play in solving global challenges in education, health, and more. Biden administration takes first step toward writing key AI standards. Dog Cancer Treatment Imprimed aims to expand its AI technology into human oncology. American Telemedicine Association publishes Principles of AI. AI revolutionizes policing and security at the Olympics and beyond. Washington lawmakers propose legislation for AI task force. Top Republican talks AI arms race, you'll have machines competing with each other. AI can create more jobs than it potentially eliminates, Tech Mahindra's outgoing CEO. Aurora to look at the use of artificial intelligence. Chief Digital, Artificial Intelligence Office to host a hackathon in Hawaii. 2024 US NDAA boosts nuclear cybersecurity, highlights artificial intelligence. Hope OpenAI's new board can steer it to a more stable structure, says Andrew Ng. One million pound prize opens for AI innovations in energy, environment, and infrastructure. White House tackles concerns over Chinese interest in Middle East AI as firm tries to play both sides. Chinese firms look to Malaysia for assembly of high-end chips, sources say. OpenAI lays out a plan for dealing with the dangers of AI. 2024 is the world's biggest election year ever, and AI experts say we're not prepared. EU agencies adopt work plan on AI in medicines regulation. 
AI integration strategies require patient focus, partnerships. There's a key capability that governments must acquire while framing AI regulation, says UK's Minister of AI. Artificial intelligence can predict events in people's lives, researchers show. UK's fastest supercomputer, Isambard AI to open in Bristol in 2024. Canadian healthcare startup Lydia AI expands reach in South Korea. New Jersey Governor and Princeton President announce AI collaboration. AI's billion-dollar copyright battle starts with a font designer. Productivity gains from AI to boost economic growth in 2024 and beyond. Lawsuits take aim at use of AI tool by health insurance companies to process claims. Gen Robotics chosen among top three Indian startups at Global AI Summit. Singapore's Atomionics taps gravity, AI in hunt for critical minerals. Airbnb using AI to crack down on New Year's Eve parties. Japan government to mandate AI-generated content detection technologies, draft guidelines aim to guard against misinformation. Boots expected to launch, AI personal shopper. Commercial International Bank Egypt selects IBM Artificial Intelligence for integration of services. Up to half of Canadians could be using AI on the job within three years, indicating a massive shift in the way we work. Experts highlight the importance of equitable and ethical AI research. Generative AI is expected to have transformative effects across various industries, including manufacturing. Wall Street analysts predict that three, magnificent seven, AI stocks will surpass Apple and join the $3 trillion club. Nvidia's stock price slips as Edgewater Research sees mixed data points for AI and GPU demand. New research explores the influence of AI on the programmatic advertising industry. Versus, an AI research company, pens an open letter to OpenAI inviting collaboration to explore a new path to artificial general intelligence, AGI. Bill Gates predicts a massive technology boom over the next decade due to AI development. Experts predict that AI will transform people's strategies and in many industries, including cloud networking and marketing. AI is expected to play a significant role in the future of work, with up to half of Canadians using AI on the job within three years. Indian Prime Minister Modi calls for public alertness on new AI technologies and emphasizes the need for regulation. Students from a Swiss boarding school issue a global AI charter calling for regulation. Microsoft is named a leader in AI governance by IDC. Generative AI is highlighted as a transformative force in multiple domains, including people strategy, CPG operations, and cybersecurity. Experts recommend five generative AI stocks to watch in 2024. A study finds that clinicians could be fooled by biased AI, even when provided with explanations. Students from a Swiss boarding school issue a global AI charter calling for regulation. India is preparing AI regulations and exploring the influence of generative AI on its digital transformation. Australia is implementing a digital ID system that will impact how citizens interact with businesses online. Canada is joining a Red Sea mission to protect ships from attacks, despite lacking certain capabilities. OpenAI's board has the power to veto CEO Sam Altman's decisions on releasing new AI. Patronus AI has found alarming safety gaps in leading AI systems. U.S. Senators are proposing tough fines for AI-driven securities fraud or market manipulation. A new study reveals similarities between the memory processing of AI models and the brain's hippocampus. Amsterdam has emerged as a thriving hub for AI startups. AI's top research conference morphed into a recruiting extravaganza, reflecting the intense competition for talent in the field. Generative AI is being used to create engagement-bait content on Facebook, such as AI-generated images of wood carvings. Generative AI is also being used to spread pro-China propaganda on YouTube. Generative AI is transforming the banking, financial services, and insurance BFSI, sector. Harvey, a generative AI platform, has announced an $80 million investment. A healthcare AI startup backed by General Catalyst has cut staff after pledging to hire aggressively. Florida lawmakers are considering bills to regulate AI. India's Prime Minister Modi has called for public alertness on new AI technologies. HR will play a key role in preparing organizations for the implementation of AI. Google has expanded the rollout of its Gemini AI chatbot to the UK. A Chevy dealership's AI chatbot suggested a Ford F-150 when asked for the best truck. 
OpenAI has released a new safety plan for its most advanced AI models, including the ability for the board to reverse safety decisions. Dropbox is facing accusations of sharing user data with OpenAI without consent. Microsoft is emphasizing the importance of trust and privacy in the AI era. Researchers have developed a supercomputer that mimics the human brain, which could help unlock the secrets of the mind and advance AI development. OpenAI is offering $10 million in grants to support research on superintelligent AI control. AI could potentially widen the racial wealth gap in the US by $43 billion. INTE Lepier is now offering generative AI solutions to its customers. Garden is using generative AI and synthetic data to drive plant growth. Lightmatter, a developer of photonic chips for AI, has reached unicorn status with a $155 million investment. ARCANA.AI, http colon slash slash ARCANA.AI, has raised $3.5 million to advance its decision intelligence platform. A study suggests that corporate legal departments should lean into AI. Decision Point is an innovative analytics and member experience optimization company. The Chinese tech giant's stock in Hong Kong has seen an impressive rise of over 30% since mid-October. The rally is expected to continue, driven by global PC demand and excitement over the company's AI-related products. Eddie Yongming Wu, the group's CEO, will also serve as CEO of Taobao and Tmall Group. This move aims to promote efficient strategic coordination and high-intensity resource investment in Alibaba's core business of e-commerce. The alliance aims to advance AI research and development, and address industry challenges. Users are finding ChatGPT to be a helpful and engaging tool for a variety of tasks. ASGN is collaborating with Microsoft to invest in and pilot next-gen AI technologies, including Copilot for Microsoft 365 and Azure OpenAI service. Saudi Arabia-based Atrodec Valence has closed its seed investment round to expand its services across the Middle East and Europe. Google has limited BARD and AI search queries related to elections ahead of the 2024 U.S. presidential race. Analysts believe a new wave of AI PCs will spur increased tech spending in 2024. TBO Tech has acquired the online business of Jumbo Tours Group to expand its global footprint. SCM outlines four action items security teams can set around generative AI in 2024. Scepter Incorporated has selected Intelligent Artifacts as its machine intelligence provider for emissions monitoring. Intelligent Artifacts will leverage their AI or ML and reasoning technology as part of Scepter's highly scalable fusion and data analytics platform developed in collaboration with Amazon Web Services. The U.S. National Institute of Standards and Technology is seeking public input on AI safety and development guidelines. They are particularly interested in input on generative AI risk management and reducing risks of AI-generated misinformation. Generative AI is having a significant impact on cybersecurity. It is expected to be one of the top cybersecurity trends to watch in 2024. A Chinese professor has used AI to write a science fiction novel that won a national competition. The professor plans to share his creation process so that others can create good fiction with AI. HughesNet has launched a new satellite internet service that offers speeds of up to 100 megabits per second. The service uses AI to automatically reroute traffic around congestion. The fusion of AI and IoT is paving the way for innovation in Taiwan. This is being driven by the development of cutting-edge technologies such as generative AI and large language models (LLMs). On-device AI is expected to boost the profitability of NAND Flash. This is due to the increasing demand for AI-powered devices. AI is expected to play a major role in the fight against intellectual property theft. AI can be used to identify and track stolen intellectual property. Researchers have developed a deep learning model that can predict water quality and identify the optimal water intake layer for Juam Lake in Korea. The model could be used to improve water quality management in other lakes and reservoirs. Researchers have developed a deep learning model that can detect phishing attacks. The model uses a transformer architecture to learn patterns in URLs that are indicative of phishing attacks. Admirals, a financial services company, has partnered with Onfido to streamline client verification across Europe. Onfido uses AI to verify identities remotely. TomTom has partnered with Microsoft to create an AI-powered conversational assistant for vehicles. Researchers have developed a chemist AI agent that can autonomously create structured datasets from scientific literature. This could simplify the compilation of machine learning-ready datasets for materials discovery. 
Waimi has developed a multi-view fusion algorithm based on artificial intelligence machine learning. Japanese startup Preferred Networks is increasing its investment in customized AI chips. Several U.S. states are moving forward with legislation to regulate the use of AI. Venture capital firm Partech has launched a 360 million euro fund to support mission-critical software, data, and fintech specialists. Garden is using generative AI and synthetic data to drive plant growth. Scepter Incorporated has selected Intelligent Artifacts as its machine intelligence provider for emissions monitoring. AI is being used to deter deer from railway tracks in the UK. This innovative system is helping to reduce train collisions with deer, which can cause delays and injuries. Mercedes-Benz will present a vision of hyper-personalized UX at CES 2024. This will be made possible by AI, which will offer human-like interaction with the vehicle's virtual assistant. The Swiss AI Safety Prize is inviting people to identify vulnerabilities in large language models LLMs. The deadline for submissions is December 31, 2023. AI is shaping the cybersecurity landscape in 2024. This is due to the increasing integration of AI into cybersecurity tools and systems. A new study evaluates the use of ChatGPT as a self-learning tool in medical biochemistry education. The results of the study suggest that ChatGPT may be a useful tool for advancing medical education and research. Admirals, a financial services company, has chosen Onfido to streamline client verification. Onfido uses AI to verify identities remotely, which helps to reduce fraud and increase security. Infinite Reality IR, has released a new series of videos on CNN to redefine reality and introduce the metaverse. Samsung is revisiting its strategy to boost the launch of its OLED US XR device. A new benchmark for general AI assistance, GAIA, has been released. Online learning platform Univo has welcomed UGC recognition in India. Genesis AI, a Nigerian B2B invoice management startup, has raised 1.1 million US dollars in pre-seed funding. Data management practices are evolving to drive greater business outcomes in 2024. The adoption of knowledge graphs is being driven by large language models LLMs. Artificial intelligence AI, is seeing increased adoption across various industries. Genesis Cloud achieved state ramp authorization, making it easier for U.S. state and federal agencies to access its AI-powered customer service platform. Stable Diffusion XL, a new AI model from Stable AI, is revolutionizing image generation. AI is being used to develop Chrome extensions, improve physical education teaching, and predict North Atlantic sea surface temperatures. There are challenges and opportunities associated with the use of AI in the workplace. Older workers may face challenges adapting to AI, but there are strategies to help them succeed. VCs are investing in early-stage tech startups that are developing innovative AI solutions. Google has rolled out an upgrade to its AI chatbot Bard in the UK. Dunn & Bradstreet and IBM are collaborating to develop responsible generative AI solutions. Irish consumers have mixed feelings towards the use of AI in retail. The market for predictive analytics is expected to grow significantly in the coming years. Zindi is helping to connect businesses with data science talent in Africa. The University of Florida is funding a variety of projects that leverage AI, including a space institute, a construction automation project, a sports performance initiative, and an agricultural sustainability effort. Apple is expected to release Vision Pro, an advanced version of AirPods, and watches in the coming year. Vision Pro will allow users to record spatial videos. Manufacturing CEOs are embracing AI, automation, and robotics to accelerate reshoring and invest in high-tech talent. They are also upskilling their current employees and recruiting highly trained workers. Paytm is betting on young wealth and AI automation to hit profitability sooner than targeted. The company plans to revamp its online wealth management services and hire more than 50,000 salespeople to get more merchants on its network. WorldCoin, a crypto startup co-founded by OpenAI CEO Sam Altman, has unveiled a major expansion to its eye-scanning identity platform. CrowdStrike has surpassed $1 billion in sales with its strategic partner Optiv. The partnership has seen more than $1 billion in sales of CrowdStrike's AI-native Falcon platform. Several companies are developing new AI-powered translation solutions. Vocapia and Systren have demonstrated an automated speech translation solution, Facebook has announced that statistical machine translation has reached end of life, 
and Instagram is adding automatic in-app text translation. ChatGPT can be used to create impactful presentations, but it cannot organize slides or provide a .pptx file. A tutorial on Fritz AI demonstrates how to build a cat or dog classification flutter app with TensorFlow Lite. AI-powered solutions are being developed to help people balance their screen time. A new AI model called Life2Vec has been shown to predict individuals' time of death with high accuracy. The model was trained on the personal data of over 1 million individuals in Denmark. UKTN has published predictions for the UK fintech industry in 2024. AI is being used to discover new drugs. Traditional drug discovery methods are limited because they only explore a tiny fraction of the possible chemical space. AI can explore a much larger space and identify promising drug candidates that would be missed by traditional methods. Computational design has been used to create synthetic optical barcodes in microdroplets. These barcodes can be used to track individual cells across different instruments, which could have a wide range of applications in biology and medicine. AI compliance is a growing concern, as the industry faces new regulations in 2024. Companies that use AI will need to ensure that they are compliant with these regulations to avoid legal and ethical problems. Indian AI companies are hiring interns in 2024. This is a great opportunity for students and recent graduates who are interested in getting involved in the AI field. AI content can rank in Google search results. This means that businesses can use AI to generate content that can help them attract more visitors to their websites. AI-powered analytics platforms are revolutionizing the marketing landscape. These platforms allow marketers to make more data-driven decisions, which can lead to more effective marketing campaigns. A new 3D material has been found to break down an antidepressant that contaminates water bodies worldwide. This material could be used to clean up contaminated water and protect the environment. Some brands are starting to disavow AI content as a way to differentiate themselves. These brands believe that AI content is not as authentic as human-generated content. AI is having a major impact on the finance industry. Banks and other financial institutions are using AI to automate tasks, improve customer service, and reduce fraud. Experts predict that 2024 will be a year of reckoning for AI. This is the year when the hype around AI will start to die down and people will start to focus on the real capabilities and limitations of the technology. The chips that power AI are becoming increasingly sophisticated. These chips are essential for running the complex algorithms that power AI applications. AI's memory forming mechanism is strikingly brain-like. This suggests that AI may eventually be able to achieve human-level intelligence. Smart offices are using IoT integration to create a more intelligent and responsive environment. This can lead to increased productivity and employee satisfaction. Students in India have developed a solution to detect phishing attacks using AI. This solution could help to protect people from online scams. Space42, a new AI-powered space tech company, is launching in the MENA region. Generative AI is transforming supply chain management. AI professionals are expected to be the highest paid in five years. A new AI model is earning $10,000 a month as a fake influencer. Mediatek and NVIDIA are partnering to bring AI to cars. Walls.ai is a new tool that allows users to chat with PDFs. Google Labs has a new design featuring 12 AI experiments. The FTC has banned Rite Aid from using facial recognition. Google's AI Code Assistant is now free for everyone. Google has released a new AI tool called VideoPoet that can generate videos from text. Google Bard now supports 18 programming languages in Replit. YouTube will label AI-generated videos ahead of the 2024 US election. Microsoft Suno on Copilot allows anyone to create music with AI. TomTom and Microsoft are collaborating on a generative AI assistant for cars. Crea, AI-powered design tool for images and videos. Nolly, connects any apps to AI agents. Picopilot, AI-powered e-commerce image tool. New research paper proposes a new deep neural network regularization measure. Tutorial on how to calculate L2-MSE loss in PyTorch. Study finds that large language models struggle to decode SEC filings. Generative AI music is gaining popularity, with Microsoft Copilot releasing a free Suno extension. AI-generated images are being used to create fake Facebook pages. 
Product Hunt features two new AI products, Linkay.ai and Snowball. Protect Star Antivirus AI Android earns AV test certification. Researchers develop machine learning for automated experimentation in scanning transmission electron microscopy. Banking industry is ready to embrace AI, but there are concerns about regulation and potential for errors. Generative AI is transforming creative industries. ChatGPT is accused of promoting leftist political leanings. DAX Copilot is a tool for lawyers that uses AI to generate legal documents. Online expertise and training platforms have advantages over in-person delivery, including lower cost and greater adaptability. Samsung Galaxy S24 will be an AI phone with a generative AI model. IBM has released a Python library for generative AI. Law firms are embracing legal tech, including generative AI chatbots. Large language models are becoming increasingly important in the legal field. Generative AI platform Harvey has raised $80 million in funding. AI is being used to develop dynamic scheduling systems and predict net ecosystem productivity. Most companies are planning to roll out AI applications, but many are not yet ready. A new digital healthcare framework for patients with disabilities has been developed using federated learning. AI is being used to automate the detection of seafloor massive sulfides. The judiciary is working to catch up with AI and other tech trends. DAX is a formula language used in Power Pivot for data modeling and analysis. Businesses should carefully consider the potential benefits and challenges of AI before adopting it. A new offline converter can convert DWG files to Excel using ChatGPT and AI. The top 10 IC design houses saw a 17.8% increase in revenue in Q3 2023, driven by AI chip demand. Oshrock has released a new motherboard series with Intel Core Ultra processors and AI capabilities. Google Brain co-founder says he could not get ChatGPT to kill us all. Amazon has launched a new service called Bedrock for generative AI applications. The debate over AI versus human skill is becoming more polarized. Data Harmony is an AI suite that leverages explainable AI for semantic discovery. AI is expected to have a significant impact on the work of EHA's practitioners. Fujitsu is using AI to save power in open RAN networks. Making privacy solutions EVM compatible is key to integrating them with blockchains and dApps. A new guide shows how to use Google Bard to accelerate Gmail productivity. A new study assesses the nature of large language models and cautions against anthropocentrism. Telenor is exiting several Asia-Pacific markets in a quest for market leadership. LinkedIn has launched audio events, a feature similar to Clubhouse. Fractal has partnered with Coursera to launch a data science professional certificate. Google Maps has been updated in India with new features, including integration with Lens, which uses AI to simplify searching. Research has found that smaller language models can produce better clinical translations than larger ones. Coca-Cola has launched AI-powered digital cards for the holiday season. A new AI skim detection service called Scamio has been launched. Experts predict that Femtech will adopt AI and machine learning in 2024. GEA has launched a custom AI chatbot based on Microsoft Azure OpenAI service. Aladata is working on a project for early diagnosis and screening of lung cancer using AI. Huawei has released a new lightweight laptop with a 16-inch screen and a 13th Gen Intel Core i9-13900H processor. Google has released Gemini, its most powerful AI model to date. Researchers have developed a digital simulator to help close the design-to-manufacturing gap for optical devices. Experts are calling for AI literacy to be taught in higher education. Metasecond.ai is hosting a Christmas sticker giveaway. AI is transforming various industries, including marketing, finance, healthcare, and more. Microsoft and Copilot have teamed up with Suno to create an AI tool that can instantly compose songs. Zoom is using a federated approach to generative AI to provide its AI companion feature at no extra cost to customers. Analysts are bullish on Bitcoin, Solana, and a suite of AI tokens, but bearish on Ethereum. The UK Supreme Court has ruled that AI cannot be an inventor, in a landmark case about AI patent rights. Google has launched a new design for labs with 12 AI experiments, tools, and projects. A Bulgarian startup called EPIX.AI is using AI to create personalized prevention protocols for age-related diseases. 
More Threads, a Chinese chip startup that was put on a U.S. trade blacklist, has unveiled a new GPU-based computing center and AI graphics card. Stability AI has launched a paid membership for commercial use of its AI models. Follow and subscribe to AI Trends YouTube channel for latest AI industry updates and trends.